Hi everyone, today I thought I'd give you a little talk on my uh, other hobby which is photography. Um, I got into it about, say about five or six years ago. Um, I just love going to, you know, different places, uh, capturing the spirit of those places, you know, just exploring, finding things to take photos of and it's a really good hobby. I mean, it gets you out to see, you know, different parts of the country that you want to take photos of and um, you know, you've just got so many opportunities, you've got, you know, sunrises, sunsets, spring, summer, autumn, winter, and all the really wonderful times of the year to take photographs. So, um, I thought I'd share with you today what I actually use to take my photos. Behind me we've got a photo that I took a couple of weeks ago, this is at Himley Hall, this is just a sunset with a little basic contrast editing that I like to do, so I am pretty proud of that, that I actually got a put up on um, Midlands Today's Facebook page so I was quite happy about that and it got a few more likes on my Facebook page so this is the camera I use this is the Kodak Easy Share Z981 and it's a HD camera so if I just take the lens off it's got like a pretty good lens I'll turn it on not on that setting uh, so yeah this is quite big how far the lens goes out and I wouldn't change it for the world. I mean, I know a lot of people like to have um, SLRs and, you know, different kinds of cameras, but this has been my saviour for about five years now. My fiancé bought it me for Christmas in 2010, and I've just, I don't know what I'd do without it. I've got some of my best photos captured with this camera, and I'm so proud of them. My favourite function on it is the macro setting, where you can... Um, zoom in quite close and capture quite a lot of detail on the subject that you're taking a photo of like say um, I got a really good photo of a damselfly last year when I was uh, again at Himley Hall and there's just so much detail in the um, in the photo you can see like the tiny hairs on its legs it's you know the the quality of its eyes because it's got a lot of eyes and um, just the colour of it it captures just anything I want perfectly, it's good for landscapes, it's good for close-ups, it's good for people, it's just, it's the best camera I've ever owned. Um, aside from taking, you know, lots of good photos on this, I've also got a smaller camera which I like to take out with me on a night out. This is the Olympus um, five times wide optical zoom and it's just just a basic small camera. I had this off my mum and dad for my birthday last year because if I'm not about taking photos with this, I'll take photos with this or my phone. I prefer to take this out with me um, if if I go on a night out or, you know, when this is sometimes too much of a burden to carry. Um, and I know I'm not taking like, you know, you know, not spending time taking really good photos with this. So this is a lovely little camera. It served me really well the last year or so. And um, yeah, it's a good little camera. I don't actually do photography for a living. It's just a hobby at the moment. Um, I do, I really would love to get somewhere with it in life. Um, but at the minute it's just friends, close friends and family who get to see what photos I take. Um, I've got a photography page on Facebook that I try and keep updated as much as I can. It's kind of a struggle to juggle the two pages, the my beauty blog and the photography page. So I, I do tend to it when I can and when I've actually been out to take photos with this little beauty. So it's, um, I just sort of give you a talk on what else I like to do. Um, I mean, obviously this year I'm going to have a lot more trips to do and take this out and take lots more photos, hopefully some really, really good ones that I can get out. And I'm also thinking about starting to sell my photos on canvas to friends and family because there's quite a few of my, um, my friends at work who have, um, you know, expressed interest in having some of my photos on canvas in their living rooms, which I'm absolutely over the moon about. And it's just a really nice feeling to know that somebody else appreciates your work and they want it in the living room or you know it's somewhere in the house framed and where people can see it so it's um it's quite an honor i should say to um to be asked 
if I can put my photos onto canvas so I'm going to try and see if I can get that done uh, later on this year so what I'm going to do as well is because I'm going to do a bit of uh, you know self promotion now shameless self promotion if you'd like to see more photos um, and more of my work I'll leave the link below to go to my um, my Facebook page it's just simply called Brogan J Photography um, I spend a lot of time taking photos and putting them up so if you'd love to see more and I'd love for you to like the page just head on over to Facebook and give me a like um, I think that concludes the photography talk it was going to be a short one anyway just to let you know what else I like to do aside from putting on instead of putting on my makeup and you know uh, video blogging it, reviewing stuff. I do like to do other things, so yes. Thanks for watching. Oh, anyway, so I oh, will see you next time.